Poro is a barangay in the province of La Union in the Philippines. Its 276 hectares border the coast of the South China Sea. It is home to around 5,700 people, including a thriving community of fisherfolk and their families. In June of 2014, a grant from Chevron Philippines Incorporated, marketer of Caltex Fuels and Lubricants, was awarded to the Institute for Social Order, or ISO, in order to implement the Poro Marine Protected Area and the Poro Sea Lovers Association, or PSLA. The PSLA was formed in order to protect Poro's natural resources and for the betterment of the community and the whole barangay. Their initial task was to patrol the marine protected area off the Poro coast. The MPA Council organized 101 members to take on their mission through door-to-door -door recruitment. The Poro Sea Lovers Association has also partnered with the Poro Local Government Unit, the City Government of San Fernando, and the Poro Point Management Corporation to ensure sustainability. Later, in November of 2015, the MPA Council came together to expand their initiatives. Established under the Poro Sea Lovers Association, Luto T. Poro is a catering service that provides local cuisine to residents, workers, and institutions in Poro and San Fernando City. The MPA Council set out to develop a new livelihood source for the community and agreed upon a catering business. They created the eatery and catering business called Luto T. Poro, which in the local language of Ilocano means Poro Cuisine. Its objectives are to provide additional livelihoods to members and an alternative to overdependence on fishing. The members of the MPA Council are responsible for the operations of Luto Tipuro. Their operations are centered around their core values of stewardship, commitment, accountability, transparency, respect, and honesty. They stay focused on their work for the betterment of their community and for their children. Due to strong competition in the eatery business, Luto Tipuro streamlined its operations to catering in 2016. They cook, package, and deliver food to customers around the Poro Barangay. Their sales have grown from 2016 to 2017, showing their continued success. They can support events for up to 200 people at a time. The most popular product at Luto Tipuro is their tasty dry fish snack called Spicy Dillies. The spicy dillies are made of small fried fish mixed with a variety of spices and sugars. Okay. The fish and ingredients are sourced from the local market and prepared at the Luto Tiporo kitchen by the MPA Council cooks. These snacks are made fresh to order at their location in Poro. Orders can be placed in person or by phone. The profits from Luto Tiporo are used to cover operational costs and pay employees. Beyond that, they are reinvested into the equipment and utensils needed to expand the business. They also support a community lending program designed to offer members access to financial resources. A lump sum of 20,000 pesos was contributed from Luto Tiporo to begin the lending program in September of 2017 and has grown to 28,000 pesos in the first three months. 5% of the Luto Tiporo profits fund quarterly beach and coastal cleanups for the betterment of the community, the environment, marine life, and future generations. Luto T. Poro has strong partnerships with the Institute of Social Order, the Poro Local Government Unit, the San Fernando City Government, and Poro Point Management Corporation, who serve as their main customers. The Poro Point Management Corporation, a government-mandated organization tasked with the development of tourism and employment opportunities in Poro Point, has developed an ecotourism plan to be implemented by 2020, with the Poro Marine Protected Area as the focal point of the project. Poro Point will be converted into a hub for international tourism and trade. It will include an 18-hole golf course, resorts, recreational facilities, a port for yachts and cruise ships, and more. The members of Luto T. Poro look forward to expanding their catering business opportunities with the increased traffic and potential customer base. In the coming years, with increased marketing, the Spicy Dilly's snack has the potential to be scaled up dramatically. Ecotourism and the scaling up of Spicy Dilly's will produce greater profits for Luto T. Poro and the Poro Sea Lovers Association. This will in turn benefit the Poro community and the MPA. The thriving Luto T. Poro business looks forward to continued growth and future opportunities to support the Poro Sea Lovers Association the marine protected area, and the local community.